Oh, we're so drunk. I'm so drunk. <laughs> I just need to be sick over here. Hello, guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Metal Gear Rising Revenge. I'm Rabbit Luigi, and in the last episode, we kind of got told that we're a bad guy. We should feel bad for our actions, and as a result, we're kind of screwed up. Um, we Basically, all these people over here, they're bad guys. Uh, but we shouldn't feel that they're bad guys. So... We kind of like screwed up a little bit. We're walking a bit like this. It's it's we can't really fight anybody. We kind of it's 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 not a good situation. But thankfully, you know, attacking is a bit bad. But oh well. Thankfully, we go up here, uh, and hopefully, if all goes well, we should we should trigger a, we should be able to trigger a cutscene, which can help us with that. I mean, it's not the best thing. We can't go through the game like this. Um, so <laughs> it's very simple, basically. Um, apparently, well, actually, <laughs> let's just kill these guys. I'm not sure how we can kill, don't shoot me. I'm not sure how we can kill these guys because, well, <laughs> it's not going to work. You can see it's not going to work. Oh, that was good. That was a good shot. Um, it can't really, there's not a lot we can do. We can, like, we're going to swing at you. I'm going to get you. See, I can kill one. Let's fucking kill one. Look, I, look, mate, mate, I can't do anything. Stop talking to me. Did I kill him? No, he's up. I'm not sure you can kill these guys. They have the self-generating... That, that might have killed him. The self-generating uh, thing, which, like... The thing, the thing that the Zandatsu gets rid of. The thing we take out of them. Oh, we can't attack anymore. That's annoying. We just walk around and say, Oh, there's um, Jetstream Sam coming out of the building. He's talking to me. Stop talking to me, man! I don't care. You're probably... Fuck you! That's nice. You're a nice guy. Oh well. So now we have a very interesting cutscene. I'm going to be quiet for most of this, so it's quite important. So this is our new, this is the boss we are facing next. He's Monsoon. Spoilers. Thank you very much. He's a bit of an asshole. Don't really like this guy. The the, the fight's annoying. Uh, I may have to edit some of this fight. It's oh, it's annoying. So anyway, I'm going to be sh I'm going to shut up during this cutscene. It's quite important. So see you in a bit. Feasting on the insides of your enemies? How easily you ignore the loss of life when it suits your convenience. So tell me, who saves the weak from the man who saves the weak? You're the ones exploiting them. You take advantage of their weakness. Of course they get hurt when you set them up as your human shield. Kill or be killed, Jack. Phnom Penh taught me that. Yes. You are Actually, apparently we've technically got we technically got control here as well, which is a little bit weird. All we can do is turn the camera. Um, still got the talking. I'm, I'm, oh yeah, I'm just gonna see you in a bit. Whatever. I can do Hello, how you doing? I'll go, go back to him. It's like a good cutscene. See you in a bit. The DNA of the soul. They shape our will. They are the culture. They are everything we pass on. Expose someone to anger long enough, they learn to hate. They become a carrier. Envy, greed, despair, unbelief. How about full of shit? Is that a meme? You can't fight nature, Jack. Wind blows, rain falls, and the strong prey upon the weak. Ugh. Sam tells me you see your weapon as a tool. Something that saves lives, a means of justice. Now there's a pretty meme. Exquisite. It spared you the burden of all the lives you take. Absolved you of guilt when you enjoyed it. That is, until the illusion was broken. 
Don't be ashamed. It's only nature running its course. You have no choices to make, nothing to answer for. You can die with a clear conscience. You're right. About me, I mean. I knew something was off. After the Patriots, I thought I could walk off the battlefield and into a normal life. But here I am, surrounded by death, arguing philosophy with terrorists. I told myself this was about justice, about protecting the weak, but I was wrong. <laughs> then you admit it. I learned young that killing your enemies felt good. Really good. In America, my friends, my family, they helped me forget the devil inside. But who am I kidding? I was born to kill! Oh. The bit about my sword, that means of justice stuff, I guess I needed something to keep the Ripper in check when I was knee-deep in bodies. You? But you, all this is a wake-up call to what I really believe, what I really am. What are you saying? I'm saying Jack is back. Oh, shit. Shit, son. Shit, son, on a shit sandwich. <laughs> Doctor, turn off my pain inhibitors. What? This, this is madness. You do it. All right. This is kind of cool. It goes all sort of mad worldy. It's not really, but it's all sort of black and white. The only thing you can see is red. Which isn't bad. Pain. This is why I fight. Fighting for pain, as you do. <laughs> this is my normal. My nature. You've lost your mind. I love this no, guy. Sam. It's so funny. Report back to the chief. I'll take this dance. He's mine. Do you know how to tangle? <laughs> You're the boss. I misjudged you. You are like us after all. Now you're just being nasty. <laughs> that nickname you love so much. Wanna know how I got it? You wanna know how I got these scars? Why don't I give you a demonstration? Actually, that was genuinely the thing which I thought of when he said that first time. I think it's time for Jack to let her rip. Oh no, man. Have you seen what you've done? You've let Jack the Ripper out of his cage. Now, mm, you think, oh, that sounds so cool. That makes me feel a great boss fight, but it doesn't. Because Monsoon is actually really annoying. I'm, just look at this. I'm sort of guessing. Where are you? Fuck! Get it! Get out of here! Oh, <laughs> some of these things are really hard to avoid. They're even harder when you stand like that. When when you're um when you can't dodge. Get fuck. Okay. <laughs> like, don't, okay. <laughs> so, the big thing about this boss is he's fun until he either makes himself invulnerable or you can't see him. Because you know this isn't so bad. I'm still sort of hacking up. This is annoying. I can't get rid of this. There we go. I'll go for it. Oh. <laughs> Coming to get you. I'm coming to get you, son. I'm gonna hack. I'm try and parry you. I'm not sure parrying works with this guy. Be a my Arab. Go away. Now. <laughs> this isn't. This isn't. This isn't so bad. You know, you can whack him with strong attacks, and you know, you're getting his health down pretty quickly. 
You know, this is, this is a good fight. Then he does this, which I think is where he is. He throw is where he throws the tanks. The thing comes out of his head. Might be where he throws for tanks and stuff. We can't hit him because he's up there. We need a rocket launcher. I haven't got any rocket launchers left. Here we go. Here comes the helicopter, which is already on fire. We gotta like chop it up. Oh no, chop it up more. Than, okay, chop it up more than once. There we go. Can't do a Zandatsu. That'd just be way too cool. Did that drop a? That drop. What did it drop? A uh, grenade. Yeah. More of them. Two. He gets up to like seven or something crazy. It's like whatever. Why can't the guy just fight us normally? What are these? Grenade and uh, nano. I've already got nano pace. I should use some of them. I probably have to because. Look at this. Just okay. Just just check this out. We, we, you can't hurt him. He put glow, he glows purple. We saw it in the cutscene where he sort of it's a kind of cool design where he his limbs are kind of all detached and and, and then he does this. I was like, Ugh. so I can't hit you and you can I, I can't hit you. I can't see you and you'll just look at this. I can't do anything. I'm just dodging. It's good I know how to dodge now. BMI. Fuck you. Where are you? Where are you? So you. Ugh. I hate this fight. I do hate this fight. It's not like a really bad fight. I think it's just badly implemented. It's like, oh, look at this attack! I can't attack him. I, I want to get up close again. I keep cat. This thing keeps getting in the way. Look at, look at this. I ca oh. you can't do anything against it. He's just gonna hack away at you. You can't attack him. Look at it. Just fly through him. Do it again. Fly through him. I can't attack this guy. Basically, it comes down to. I think he loses his head. Literally loses its head, um, and then you attack the head. And you need to attack him some point. I can't remember when. I just I don't care. Let's just go. <laughs> Come on. Do something interesting. Do something anything. That's not interesting. Ah, oh, there we go. Yeah. So you have to attack the head. I think that's the head. Do some. Is that blade mode? I think blade mode is not going to work. All right. Now we can attack him normally. That's but like at the start of the fight. I should have a proper fight where I can attack you. I'm gonna get out of this. Or not get out of that. That was annoying. I, that is a hard thing to get out of. You have to really go for it. And my PS3 controller's slightly broken. Um, from all the times I've been doing that previously. It's slightly broken. Um, not, it's not too bad. It's nothing major. I mean, my, um, I've got a game controller that's the, um, fuck, oh, this move. <laughs> uh, it immediately goes into this. And I can't dodge that! I cannot dodge that. I'm sure it hurts. Fuck. Well, I haven't got any pain in him, so probably not. So fuck you. I'll get you on the floor, and I'm gonna hack you to pieces, and you're gonna like it. You're going up there. You're such a freaking coward. You're worse than the blade wolf, where it is. More blade mode. I'm gonna get this one and that one, and this one's gonna turn into sashimi. Yeah. I think one of these is a nano paste. Let's use one. No, that's the yeah. There we go. Nano paste. Use it. Did I use use square. Okay, use a square. Then there we go. Is that nano paste? That was a nano paste. Okay, cool. Let's go. Let's go, son. Is that? Oh no, maybe. That yeah, that one. There we go. Need to, it's the last one, which is one you have to slice into many pieces. And there's all these crap on the floor, but I don't. Both of these already got max off. Maybe some grenades there somewhere. A couple of EM grenades. I'm not really going to use them. These fucking. Okay. Uh, <laughs> calm. It's just a boss fight. Just a boss fight. Nothing you can do to hurt you except it'll be really, really annoying. His legs are coming to attack me. Go fuck yourself. There we go. Get on the floor. I see one blade. Oh, I see one blade mode you to death. Now you're, now you're a normal person. Now I can attack you. I can attack you like a. What? Now. This this boss fight, this boss fight is a is a bitch. What's this bit? This bit where he rolls it on the floor. Laurent Laurent's force. Okay, can I blade mode this? No, no, I can't blade mode that. Oh my God, that's annoying. I'm just gonna run. I might just, I'm just, I don't know. I don't know. Can I can I really not blade mode that? Oh no, <laughs> really, really can't. Especially if you're facing the wrong way. I mean, you know, that doesn't help. Oh, what just hit me? What was that? Well, okay. Okay, then. Have it your way. Yeah, slippery son of a bitch. Have you won this? I've got lots of fairies and bathroom dads. You can hit me from miles. Like, why can't I do that? 
I, I, uh, I can't make commentary. I can't make commentary when he's smacking me like this. It's a little bit stupid. Oh. I, just, I can't. He's invulnerable. I can't do anything about this. I can't do anything about this. Probably. That's probably an easier way of doing it. But I can't. Dizzah! Well, 10.7%. How do you. How do I feel about that? Not good. It's just well, I can dodge. Can you dodge? I can dodge. Oh, yeah. Look at my dodging. I'm a dodgy character. Ha <laughs> ha. Legs are coming to get me again. Don't, because I can dodge. Can you dodge? The body's going to whack me to pieces. I don't like you. I don't like you. I like the sort of philosophical message you bring and how Raiden turns into a fucking psychopath. But you're a bad boss. I don't like you. I have to wait for something. Wait for him to just be able to sever his friggin' head. Doesn't make me happy. This boss is the opposite of making me happy. It makes me angry. Is he actually more off by himself? No. Oh, oh, I fought for that one. What have you got? Oh, that's what you've got now. That's almost funny, but oh, I'm gonna... There we go. I'm gonna have you. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna, oh, I fucking hate this boss. <laughs> oh, I can dodge now. I couldn't dodge the first time I played this. I tr I trouble with you first time, but now I can dodge. Can you dodge? I think you can... Oh, why would you... Oh, I got him. I got him. Where is he? I'm guessing. There he is. Oh, that was good luck. Uh, oh, there he... No, no, no. BM, BMI. No. Where, oh, I got him by accident. That was good. I threw him in the air by accident. And he's up on the pillar. Pillar, probably by accident. Is this the last bit? This might be the last bit. Yeah, it's a terrifying form. Learn to love it. And to relish it. Yeah, oh, one, two, three, four, five. Oh, that's just five, five's the last one, okay. Into pieces, blah, 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 blah. Into pieces, blah, 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 yeah. Blah, 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 blah. Any more? Any more, son? Oh my god, that's a lot. <laughs> Here we go. Here comes the fun. Da, 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 da. Here comes the fun, and I see you. He's all right, and the helicopter's gonna get smashed by my sword. Yeah, I'm good at this game. Don't you forget it. Even though I'm playing on easy, I'm good at this game. You haven't won this. Is he invincible? Oh, he's invincible. He's invincible again. If anybody knows in the comments, how do you actually do this fight properly? Other than just waiting for him or whacking his head. And I think he needs to lose his head physically, not like mentally, like Raiden. But it's ah. Oh. Is there a way of doing? Is there a way of doing this? I feel useless. I'm losing a lot of health. I'll probably have to use another friggin' nano paste. He's difficult. He's difficult. Come on, step it up. Shut up. I'm gonna hurt you. I'm gonna. What did I even do wrong? I tried to attack you and I got hurt for it. Oh yes, get him. Get him. Go after him. Kill him. Kill the bastard. I'm not doing any damage. I can't do the plane mode. Da. Ah. Oh. Oh, is this a lot? No, it's not the last bit. Got another one of these to deal with. I can't. I think there's a way of dealing with this. I can't remember. I can't remember. Here we go. I'm gonna blade mode. Blade mode doesn't work. Okay. I'm glad we've established this. I'm low on health again. I don't want to fight that. But I have to. What did it hit me? I dodged that. Surely. I don't want to. What? Ah. Oh, what just? I don't even know. I don't even know. I'm scared of that, because I can't do much about that. They're throwing explosives at me. That might be what stunned me last time. Just a guess. Don't even know what hit me that time. I'm so confused. Here we go. This is the final bit. This is the final bit of the battle, I think, if I'm right. I feel like I'm mon mon monolith. Monolith? I don't know. I don't know my language. You think I learned my language? I don't know English. I'm American, and so you should, you should believe that I'm American from my accent. Buddy, come on! I know exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna press R1 and run it up, run up it. It's gonna stop moving, move, moving, moving. I'm gonna slice you in half. Then I'm gonna go for you. Quick time event in the wall. Jump up and down on you and slice you into many pieces. And how many pieces can I do? And then one off the end. There we go. That was the. F that was that boss. Holy cow. Oh. I didn't like that. I got B. That wasn't bad. But I don't like that boss. 
It's it's annoying on so many levels. So, bugger. Kill or be killed. Don't be ashamed. It's only nature running. I like how Raiden still has this growly voice. I'm an angry man. It's a little bit weird. And yeah, I'm sure we should feel very sad about it. He died believing what he should. That he died with the memes and the interesting thing. But I don't like that boss. Really don't like that boss. Right in. Ugh. I'm How we doing, crew? Relax. I'll get the brains. I'm gonna need that patching up. I'm sure there's someone we some some doctor guy. For anyone else. Out there. He can really help you. Oh, okay, fine. <laughs> That's the end of that chapter, I think, if I'm right. It's 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 an okay chapter. Quite a sort of interesting way of doing things, but uh, it annoys me. Anyway, that's the end of chapter three or four, depending how you're counting it. Rank C. That's not so bad. Of eighty thousand. Uh, well, what I'm going to do because it's quite a late episode and I don't really want to talk about anything else is this being Rebel Luigi. This has been Metal Gear Rising Revengeance, and in the next episode, we are going to be taking down, uh, what are they called again? World Marshal. World Marshal. Uh, and my lap, my laptop's just run out of power. My, I don't, I really hope this hasn't screwed a thing up, but my laptop's just run out of battery. That's how, that's how long the episode's been. My laptop was quite well charged before this. It's now run out of power. So, this has been Rabbit Luigi. This has been Metal Gear Rising Revengeance. It doesn't look like it, but it has been. Uh, and in the next episode, we're going to take down some bad guys. So, thanks for watching. Apologies for the kind of abrupt end. Hopefully my mic's still recording. Hopefully. Uh, and I'll see you next time. Take care.